let mod a1 bar is equals to 3 mod a2 bar is equals to 5 and mod a1 bar plus a2 bar is equals to 5 then the value of magnitude of a1 bar is equals to 3 and magnitude of a2 bar is equals to 5 and magnitude of a1 bar plus a2 bar is equals to 5 mod a1 bar plus a2 bar is equals to square root of a1 square plus a2 square plus 2a1 a2 cos theta so resultant of the given two vectors a1 and a2 is equals to 5 firing on both sides 25 is equals to we know a1 magnitude of a1 is equals to 3 3 square a2 5 5 square plus 2 into 3 into 5 cos theta by using this let us find out the angle between a1 and a2 30 cos theta is equals to 25 plus 9 plus 25 plus 34 goes to LHS side then it becomes minus 34 equals to minus 9 then cos theta is equals to minus 9 by 30 and from this cos theta is equals to minus 3 by 10 and now in this question by using this we have to find out the value of a given 2a1 bar plus 3a2 bar dot 3a1 bar minus 2a2 bar is equals to first multiply with 2a1 6a1 bar dot a1 bar then it becomes mod a1 bar whole square minus 4a1 bar dot a2 bar and now multiply with 3a2 plus 9 a2 bar dot a1 bar minus 6 a2 bar dot a2 bar so a2 bar mod a2 bar whole square and now we know the magnitude of a1 vector is 3 3 whole square becomes to 9 so 6 into 9 minus 4 into in place of a1 bar dot a2 bar take a1 a2 cos theta plus 9 into here also a2 bar dot a1 bar is equals to a1 a2 cos theta minus 6 into magnitude of a2 is 5 5 square then it becomes 25 54 minus 4 into 3 into 5 into cos theta is equals to minus 3 by 10 plus 9 into 3 into 5 into again in place of cos theta minus 3 by 10 minus 150 54 minus of minus plus 18 plus into minus minus so multiply 9 into 3 into 1.5 then it becomes 40.5 minus 150. So that is equals to minus 190.5 plus 72 equals to minus 180.2.